Hey there, ruffians. Welcome back to Rough House Place, The Walking Dead. Um, I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm extremely tired, not paying attention to anything. Dog food. So just examine downstairs for zombies. Must have stopped working a while ago. <gasps> oh, Charles. Probably not the best idea right now. We need to stay frosty. Stay frosty. Oh, uh, I'll walk past the camera. Yeah, that's the thing. Back then. Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? No, but I'll take care of it. How you doing, old me? Just how's you doing? How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet, but so far, so good. How's that couch treating you, old me? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. That was weird. What do you guys think about this plan of kittens? The guy's losing it. Look, Lee, I know he's your friend and all, but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around when he goes over. Kitty's sorry. He's just been through a lot, that's all. I hope you're right. For all our sakes. I'm sorry, guys. I'm trying to even out things. About this house. Well, this house was a hell of a stroke of luck. I like it a lot better when we know for sure it's safe. I'll make sure. But right now it feels like just the break we need. The young luck's starting to turn around. I'd like to believe that. Really, I would. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. Hmm. Open this door. Go. Nothing hiding in here. Same time I found this bathroom. God, I would be so emotionally destroyed in a zombie apocalypse. Go! That's a closet. All clear in here! Just like. Just one more to check. Like this family was so happy. Now they all dead. Now they all zombies. Is that me? No. Not exactly my style. Eh, oh well. You like the violent paintings. It's only a zombie in this one. See the music change and everything. I was spooked by a mop. Uh, place ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? No, uh, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants...
wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He, Lee. Oh God, Kenny, what did you do? Lee, oh. you need to get up here now. What's wrong? It's Kenny. So stress building tension loading screen. Kenny, you've been through a lot today. But you did find Clementine. I'm sorry, kid. Rest easy. Like I said, rest easy. Now you'll be with your dog again. Sayonara. Burial for a monster. The emotions are starting. Kenny's hard as a rock. As about as friendly as one. But he's a soft spot for children. Kid, you're strong. You know what you're doing. I'm just going to take this back. I don't have to touch the controller anymore. You know what you're doing. But... Just see you're with your dog again. I shall now bury you.
Hey Clementine. Come to pay your respects. Like a good girl. Hello. Hey! Hey! Who are you? What the hell do you want from us? Lee, what's going on? I saw someone standing there by the fence. I saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me neither. Walker's a one bit. The thought of someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. We stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. No. I don't know if we'll need well enough to move. Here. Well, you better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. As soon as she's ready to go, we are moving out. I don't know if it's safe to leave just yet. Why the hell not? Walkers look to have cleared out. That's not all I'm worried about. So you'd rather just hunker down here and just let whoever's out there keep us boxed in, wait for them to starve us out? No thanks. I hate to say it, but Kenny's right. Omid's not in great shape to move, but we can't do anything for him here. Without meds or a doctor, he's only going to get worse. All right, all right. I'll head to the river with Kenny to scope out a boat, or you get Obi ready to move. What about me? You'll stay here with the group. You'll only slow us down. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Not now, Clementine. I, mean, I think it'd be best if you stayed here with Ben. I need you to watch out for Obi and Krista. Help them get ready to move out. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. I know. It's just this once. Sometimes we all have to put aside what we want for the good of the group. Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it, okay? Okay. Hey, lights burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on. Let's go see if we'll meet. So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Ben, you're not exactly our greatest choice of staying alive. No offense, Ben, but I'd feel safer if you stayed here. How am I supposed to not take offense to that? What am I, a liability? Yeah. You're terrible. Just be great. Thanks a lot for the vote of confidence. You're the entire How reason this happened. Me. You've got a long way to go to earn yours back after some of the stuff you put on. Feel me? Yeah. Yeah, I feel you. Ben, you're like the worst teammate ever. We're gonna end that with this. Ben, you suck. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. See you guys next time on Rough Plays The Walking Dead.